Hello, I'm Jake. Welcome to another How To Esla. And today we're going to take a look at how to fit the child restraint to your kick sled. So if you want to go sledding with a young child and keep them safe on top of the sled, then uh, this is the piece of equipment that you need. So firstly, we're going to open the box up and take a look at what's inside. So inside the box, we have the instructions, the child restraint itself, and a bag with some fixings. So we'll take those off. And we'll have a look at how to fit this to the sled. So here we have a kick sled. This is an Esler T7. The child restraint works on the T6, the T7, T8, and also the compact uh, ice fishing sleds that we offer as well. So you take the child restraint bracket from outside of the, the pack and you can see it has two uh, circular clamps. One will go on each side of the uprights and you can choose a height suitable for your child. I'm going to put mine about halfway in between these two cross struts here. So first thing to do is to undo the 10 millimeter nuts. There's a cross head screwdriver slot on the other side. So we'll need a cross headed screwdriver and a 10 millimeter spanner. Here we have screwdriver and spanner. We'll undo those. the nuts safely to one side. There we go. We remove the clamps. And then by hand gently, we widen the clamp and put them from behind around the frame and push them tight so that they stay in place right there. So once again, pull them open, push them through from behind so that they click onto the frame and then squeeze them tight so that they can stay in place by themselves. Then you take your child restraint bar and your first bolt and you put the bolt through, back into the child restraint bar, out the other side, take your nut, and just finger tight to begin with, just spin that nut so that it holds itself into position. You can do the same on the other side. Bolt comes in from the outside, through the child restraint bar, through the other side of the clamp, and then your nut goes on the inside here. Finger tight to begin with. There we are, you can do those up tightly. That's the first one done. Now second. And your child restraint is safely on your kick sled. You can have it deployed when your child is using the sled. When you're not using, she can fold upward nicely and out of the way. Happy sledding with the children.